Hey there guys, Nick here. I'm sat on the floor in front of our crappy gas heater. Uh, there's something wrong with it. I'm not sure what it is. I'm about to pull it apart to see what's happening. But to give you a bit of insight as to what I think is wrong with it, uh, we turn it on, it turns on, it stays on for about five minutes and then it turns itself off. We've no idea why, but I have a feeling it might be some sort of uh, thermal fuse or, uh, or an overheat sensor or something. Um, so I'm going to pull it apart. It's pretty damn old. Here, have a look at it. Oh, my lens is dirty. So this is the heater. It is a Rinnai Granada 25 and it is a hateful thing. Well, I say it's a hateful thing, but that's because it doesn't work. So let's start pulling it apart and see what happens. Unplug it from the wall. There doesn't seem to be any obvious way to get the front off. Now, just because there's no obvious way doesn't mean there isn't a way. Usually these slide up and out. I need to go get some tools. There we go. That took a bit of doing. Ugh, it's pretty filthy. All right, let's commit the most cardinal of manly sins. Reading the manual. Oxygen depletion sensor cleaning is recommended annually. I don't think that's ever been done. Where is the oxygen depletion sensor? It's not shown in that wiring diagram over there. Would you or would you not think that an oxygen depletion sensor would be included in a wiring diagram? The unit cuts off at all settings. That's basically what we have happening. Issues are remove obstruction or ventilate the room because the oxygen depletion system is operating. Okay, where is the oxygen depletion sensor? Unfortunately, I don't think this manual is going to tell me that because they want you to take it to a or have a guy come out but We don't need no guy. We'll work this out. Wiring diagram. Well, this one's different. That's interesting The wiring diagram in the manual shows the fan be a three-wire fan Whereas the diagram here shows a two-wire fan. Also, this FS doesn't appear on here so I'm not sure what the situation is, but I'm now officially confused. Let's start off simple. I like watching a guy called AVE. He likes to bumblefuck around as he puts it. And he says, try the simplest thing first. So let's try vacuuming this thing out. All right, so I'm about to try the simplest thing first, which is cleaning it out. Let's see what happens. I apologize in advance for the loud noise. Alright, so that's mostly been cleaned out. I've taken this screen filter thing off. I'll take that out to the shed later and give that a bit of a clean up. So I've gone and put the fan filter back in. If I do that, the fan turns on. So you can hear the, can you hear the sound there? Hopefully you can. I'll put the mic, the fan, really, the camera really close. But as soon as I put the filter in, there's obviously a big restriction from, from this filter. <laughs> Can you hear the difference in sound? Open. Closed. So I'm hoping that that might have just been the problem. So let's put it all back together and see if it works in more than five minutes.
Whew. All right, let's see if this stupid thing works. Check back with you guys in about 10 minutes. Well, as you can see, it's been about whoa, 45 minutes, possibly more, and it's working. Baz approves. He's now over there rolling around on the carpet. He didn't like the fact that I came over here and sat next to him. But it's working. Thank you, Bumblefuck. Your advice was most useful in this case. Um, I didn't have to pull much more apart. Just clean that filter out and off she goes. I'm going to turn it off now, though, because it is awfully warm in here. Uh, now that this has been on for some time. I've never actually experienced this heater being on because it never worked and uh, the previous owners told us that it was something to do with some internal thing so we never pulled it apart to have a look. Glad I did, glad it works now. Uh, yeah, there's only a, mm, three weeks of winter left so I'm not sure how much more use it'll get as it starts to warm up here. Uh, but yeah, thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Jazz Club.